I'm saying? This is called the... This is called the Pine Brook. Pine Brook. Check it out. It is a little creek. Well, in this case, a brook that passes right next to the street, right? So technically speaking, we are going to be fishing a ditch or a few ditches by the street. Now I got good news and I got bad news. The bad news, obviously, is that I can only whisper right now because I have no voice due to my laryngitis, right? But I am not going to let this condition affect my work. If you recall back in the days, even with two fractured ribs and a black eye, I was still shooting videos here for the channel, right? Doing what I love to do. So the good news is that I can still whisper. So we are going to whisper through this video, okay? I'm going to get started with an inline spinner. Casting on this side and casting on that side to see if there are any bigger species of fish. And after that, I'm going to do some micro fishing. I have never ever fished this place before so the main goal is to find out if there are any fish in here whatsoever in the Pine Brook in Connecticut so let's get down to the grind going to get some water in the jack o egg bucket just in case much better to handle fish right safe fish can even for the micros if there are any micros over here so all right let's get some water over here all right water off the brook is very clear as you all can see okay beautiful water here from the pine brook Connecticut so far so good let's start casting here and there all right all the way to the back beautiful very good cast oh I had a fish definitely have something biting back there definitely have something biting back there first cast something small Line spinner. Boy, that's what's up. That's what's up. Got him. Got it. Got it. Got it. Come here. Come here. I got it. I got it. Oh. What is it? What is it?
Got him. Dude, whatever it is, I got it. Ah, very nice. Anisoptera under the float. I think it's another little brook trout. This may all there is in the creek though. Yep. It's another little brook trout. Alright, here we go. Goodness gracious. I mean, they're beautiful. Don't take me wrong. Look at that. They're gorgeous. Alright. Anisoptera. Look at that, huh? Up. So I'm going to leave the numbers over here on the screen. 
I do apologize for the voice, but I mean, it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? And we did end up finding a juicy ditch with the only spot of the day that had some decent brook trout, huh? So I mean, those are native Connecticut brook trout. I definitely don't regret it, exploring this little brook. That's the wonderful thing about ditches by the road. They're always public and anyone can access it. So it is great. Anyways, if you have any ditches and little brooks around your area, definitely hit them and explore them because you just never know. All right, <clears throat> gonna take a little break for the voice. Thank you very much for watching this video. I appreciate it. I'll see you all next time. Tie lines and take it easy. Actually, it is funny that the voice is like this, but... You can whistle. No problem at all. Go figure.